second payment of $20,000 bounced on us. More than three months after his team of licensed contractors built the new Peekskill Brewery from the ground up, General Contractor Anthony Milinich says the last thing he expected to be doing is going through a stack of unpaid invoices. They owe out to me and all the subcontractors just north of nine hundred and seventy thousand dollars. Milinek says he gladly took on the somebody wants the property. The old Myers Furniture Building on South Water Street into a state-of-the-art brewery and restaurant. He hired a team of contractors to do everything from construction to plumbing to electrical work. It took forever from what I remember. Around $1.2 So far, he says the owners have paid a fraction of what he claims they owe. It's very difficult. It's very stressful. We built the building based on the agreements we had. Um, and so I'd like to keep my agreement and get everybody paid. Electrician Robert Satterelli claims he's owed more than $160,000, which he says is devastating to his small business. I feel betrayed. I'm very disappointed. We paid a trip to the brewery Thursday afternoon and talked to one of the owners. He did not want to go on camera, but tells News 12 he disputes the claims the contractors are making. In a statement, a spokesman for the brewery said, quote, we received requests for payments from the project management company for work that was never approved and was done without competitive bids. Milinik is adamant that he has reams of paperwork and emails to prove it's that like they Ty did Milburn is by the helping this guy hijack the building. And is considering taking legal action to get the money he feels he's rightfully owed. Oh, that's good to know that he has they, they went and built a building that this, they never had money the funds for. to do that. Uh, this case is very likely headed to court. The owners of the brewery tell News 12 that they've offered to pay the contractors some of the money that they owe them while they figure things out, but they say the contractors have refused. To be continued. Back to you, Scott. Because they... I'm kind of curious. How's business there? What was it, what's it like? Well, Scott, we were there at launch, and it was a very small crowd, but we're told by some in the community that during the weekends... You can hardly get a seat there. All right, people do love their beer. Thank you very much. This guy's an idiot. Well, another major story to tell you.